All right, then here's what I have for you. Um, first thing I did is I went in and uh, imported the drawing and then went in and cleaned it up. Uh, a lot of loops and stuff in here, so I cleaned it all up. Uh, what I did is you see where this one here overlaps the border. I exploded it and trimmed it all out so the border was the outside line of all this, deleted all the extra lines. Okay, did all this. The letters have quite a few uh, loops in them as well, overlaps on top of each other. Cleaned all that up and did everything there. So I just kept one copy of the drawing and then I separated these into layers. So I have a reed layer, a water layer, a lettering layer, and the border. And then when I imported all the drawing, your bitmaps, I just put them in the layers that were uh, that I'm going to apply this texture to. So the first thing I want to do is I want to hit apply a flat relief, zero height relief to this piece. Okay. So now I have my zero height relief. So I'm going to take this, I'm going to drag it over, cover the piece, highlight both, and hit apply bitmap to relief. I'm going to do it at a height of 0.1. the texture applied and I gave that texture a height point 0.1 I'm going to come in uh, change layers okay. so this is the lettering layer so the same concept I'll select all the objects I will apply a this one I want to actually apply a height to because you're lettering, you want it at point 0.5, I believe. <coughs> point 0.5, so I'm going to actually give this a tech up at the point 0.4. Actually, going to go point 0.5 because point 0.5, <coughs> you have to remember that the base layer is point 0.1. This layer is 0.5, so when you add them together, it's 0.4, and then when we add the texture to it, it will be 0.5. Okay, so do the math. Okay, so we've applied a texture to the layers. We'll do the same concept here. We'll put it over the top, select all the objects, apply bitmap to relief. Texture is applied to that. We'll go to the next layer. Here's the water layer. We'll take this, do the same concept, except the water is a quarter of an inch. So 0.25 is what we'll do this. On the height, we'll apply it. And then when we take this, Slide it over the top, select all the objects, apply bitmap to relief at a point one. We will be a quarter of an inch high above where we're going to add it to. Okay? there. Same thing here. Select the objects. Height will be 0 0.4. 0 0.5 actually. We'll actually go 0.45 because we want this to sit down just a hair. So we've applied that. We'll come in here, grab the texture, put it over the top, select both objects, apply bitmap. So we have all of those. 
just double checking a few things here. Okay, so what I'm going to do now in order to apply all of these is I have this already with the wood texture on it. So, this is the only layer active. I'm going to go up into layers. And I want to turn on the lettering. So I'm going to turn on the lettering and hit OK. So now the lettering is there. And I'm going to come up to this button here. Apply. Okay. So I'm going to merge relief. So the first one, select the base relief. That's the base relief. Select the leaf, reliefs to merge with. Okay, so we need to go in and select that relief and then select all of them that we want to merge together. Okay, so this is very important here. Instead of putting add to relief, because if you put add to relief, it's going to pick up the texture of the relief below it. So what we want to put is we want merge highest and apply it. So now the water is there, so we'll do the same thing, except now we don't have to select the letters because they're already part of the layer. So select the base relief, which is there, and now select the water relief, merge highest. up the, the texture of the relief below. So we've done all this on the border layer, so if we've done this correctly, everything will still be in its own layer here, and the border layer has all of the texture on it. Okay? Has all of the relief and everything, and then you can toolpath it from here. So like we said, pick it here, you want here, spiral, island fill relief, quarter inch ball end mill, depth needs to be at least the depth of that, so we'll go 0.61, apply to relief, edit, make sure you edit in your fill that you want at least a 85% overlap, 